Hi all folks, this is Max from uh, ionandroid.com. So today I'm going to show you how to unroot um, your phone. This is a universal guide, so you can do it on any phone. Um, this will unroot, remove super user and the SU binders. It's the same on any kind of Android device, Android smartphones, Android tablets. Um, the only thing this doesn't do is remove these, uh, if you installed Clockwork Mod Recovery or any kind of recovery. Um, you probably installed it when you rooted your phone and it doesn't get rid of that because um, I can't really do a universal guide for that because that's different for each phone but as far as root this will actually wipe all your root um, so let's do it uh, it's very simple to do and uh, this will get rid of root and uh, you will have to get go to the Play Store and uh, download this app called ESL Explorer. All right. And then install. Oop. And of course, um, I'm assuming you've rooted. Uh, if you're on a stock ROM and you didn't install any recoveries, um, some cases you might not have, you can use this method to unroot it and take it back to the store for warranty. And then open. And basically we're going to remove those uh, SU files which is the same on all Android devices. So this is a good universal guide. Go to favorites and hit the slash button there. And also go to menu, settings, and uh, enable root explore say yes allow hit allow and uh, mount file system alright and then let's go back here um, we're gonna go to system and then um, system bin and find the SU file. It's, it'll be called. Uh, you can do a list here. Go to SU under System Bin. And keep holding it and delete. Delete. All right. And then also go to go back. Hit the back button. Go to System X Bin directory. And uh, usually there's an SU there, but this one doesn't. Um, but if, if go to XBIN and find the SU file here, and also delete if you see any. Uh, for some reason, I don't have it here on my. Sometimes it it doesn't have to be on both directories, so you're fine if you don't see it. And then go to uh, System App Directory and find Super User uh, APK. And delete this too. Oops. Alright. And uh, you can do a reboot. Actually, the super user should be gone. Yeah, it's gone. So that's how you unroot um, any Android device. 99% um, of the time, this will unroot your device. Um, if you're on a stock ROM and you didn't install any recovery, this can get you completely back to stock, unrooted, no trace of rooting for most phones. Um, just wanted to make a universal guide just in case um, people are wondering, I can point to this video. That's how you get rid of the SU binaries. It's in system bin folder, system X bin folder, and also super user APK file is under uh, system apps folder. <laughs> All right. Anyway, that was how to uh, root your Android, unroot your Android device. Um, it should work on any Android device. It will unroot it. Again, if you did install Clockwork My Recovery, um, you will have to just go Google it or find it in one of my sites um, and uh, just uninstall, install the stock recovery over it after after you do this. And you can also do a stock. Um, you can also do a data factory reset in your stock recovery after you install the stock recovery and your your device will be fully unrooted um, universal guide I just wanna put this out there for those of you um, again who um, might be asking 
if you're on a stock ROM and you didn't install Clockwork Mod Recovery, and just point you to this video. Very simple to do. Works on any Android device. Anyway, if you like this video, don't forget to hit that like button here, favorite this button, um, favorite button, and the subscribe button. If you have subscribed, thanks a lot. Um, and also share this with your friends on Twitter, Facebook, or Google+. Plus. Anyway, I'm going to get high on Android, folks. And uh, have a great uh, day getting high.